gonna hit you with a short review on our dumbbells that we have. Just gonna get right into it. So we have a set of five to a hundred rubber grip dumbbells from Rep Fitness. And then we also have a set of 105s to 120 from Vulcan. Now, they're actually identical. The only difference is gonna be the nameplate on the ends. They're great dumbbells. Uh, a couple things we like about them is, I wasn't sure at first about the rubber grip part, I'll be honest with you. Come from, you know, using uh, Troy Pros or Evanco Pro dumbbells, the metal ones with the metal plates, you guys are all familiar with at most commercial gyms. Those are what I've kind of been using my whole life. Uh, never was a big fan of the, the standard rubber dumbbells with the metal handles. They just always felt really big to me, especially when you got over 80 pounds. They kind of felt like balloons, it was really balloony. These do not feel like that. These are actually 30% smaller. So if you actually, I'll post a comparison uh, picture, but these are actually shorter and a lot more compact. So that in, a, in itself to me makes a huge difference and makes it worth it to spend just a little extra money and get these over the regular hex dumbbells. Now, handle diameter. You're gonna ask that for sure, you wanna know. Five to 20 pounds, the handles are gonna be 30 millimeters, and then 25 pounds and up, you're at 34 millimeters. To me, it's the perfect size. It doesn't, um, it, there, there's no complaints about the handles. In fact, the grip with the rubber grip is really good. It doesn't slip, your hands don't slip. Even when they're sweaty, it actually just grips even better. I'm really impressed with how they feel. These are great, great feeling dumbbells. The handles themselves are five inches in, in length, so that's plenty big enough. They used to be four inches, I believe, uh, maybe five, six years ago, so that's changed now to five, and that's, it's a, the perfect length for a handle. You don't want it too big. Um, the one nice thing about the rubber grip and the coating, and to being entirely coated, is you're not gonna have any issues with corrosion or rust. These are completely sealed. So if you live in an environment that's got rain or moisture, that's something to think about. Another nice thing is with the cold weather, we don't get a ton of cold weather here in California, but if you're, I, I'm from Canada, so I can tell, tell you it's cold as hell up there. And in your garage, it's even colder. So if you're going to work out in the morning at 5 a.m. and it's minus 10 Celsius outside, you, the last thing you want to do is go grab a, a metal dumbbell handle and try to rip the set out. It's, it's not going to be fun. So you can either wear gloves or whatever you want to do, but these you don't have to do that. Same if it's super hot, that rubber just insulates your hand from the metal and you can train anytime, hot or cold. So uh, that's something that actually somebody pointed out to me. I thought it was a great idea and it, it makes a lot of sense.
Another nice thing about these is they're pretty affordable. If you look at the pricing, these are going to be a lot cheaper than a pro style dumbbell. They're kind of somewhere in the middle between the regular hex dumbbell and the pro style or say the urethane dumbbells. Now, the urethane dumbbells was one that we did consider looking at and they're just your standard round dumbbells. I see them get beat up a lot in the gyms. They just don't seem to last. One thing that uh, you know my wife and I brought up is that because they're round, they just roll around all the time. You know, to me, it's not a big deal. But these are nice with the hex. You just lay them down; they don't move. You're not rolling around your gym trying to chase after them or if you, you know, drop them or whatever. Um, so that's a nice, nice thing. I don't know. That's to me a pretty small, uh, small issue, I guess you could say. But yeah, just one thing to consider. Um, Shipping on these took a long time. The Vulcans took, I think, around four or five weeks, and then uh, reps came in stages. We got some, and then we had to wait longer for the other ones to show up. But, uh, you know, overall shipping, it's gonna take a little while. I think things are getting better with inventories down where you don't have to wait so long. We had one issue with our rep set. One of the dumbbells showed up and I caught it. The handle length here was four inches. Uh, so probably maybe some old stock or just something got messed up at the factory, but I let rep know about the problem and they sent a new dumbbell, sent the old one back. It was no big deal. Uh, great customer service. I've never had an issue with rep. They're always really good for customer service. Anything you buy, they, they stand behind it and they'll back it up. So that's it. Um, yeah, if you buy the rep set from five to a hundred, you're not gonna fit the hundreds on these two racks or rep. You're gonna have only be able to fit from five to 95. And then the hundreds are gonna be either on the floor or on another rack somewhere. We have ours on another rack. But just wanted to show you these dumbbells and let you know what we think of them and just give you a quick review. All right, thanks a lot, we'll see you.